welcome to supermacworldnz.com. My name is Hayden and today I'm going to show you how to use Dropbox to share your iTunes library over multiple computers. So, let's open iTunes. We need to go to our home folder, another folder, and go to your, should open to your home folder. So, we need to go to music and find our iTunes library. Okay, and the other one we need to go to our Dropbox and copy our iTunes library into Dropbox. I've already done this. So now we need to go into iTunes. I'm doing an iTunes 10, the latest version. If you don't have it, up, update. It does feature this great new grey. So just go into preference, um, preferences. Go into advanced and go change your iTunes library. So I'll just show that again. It's in the advanced section and iTunes media folder location and go change. Go to your Dropbox, go iTunes, choose. Okay, so now okay. I rename your new Okay, so here we go. Now now what has happened is we are now and got our iTunes, our iTunes folder with our mute with my our music in it in Dropbox itself. See, it's just in there. So we can still play music normally because it is in because it is in Dropbox on our computer. So what you have to do on other computers is do the same thing. Okay, so you just need to go into iTunes and repeat the same processes you just did and choose your iTunes media folder as Dropbox. And then if you delete a, if you delete a music file on one computer, it'll be gone on the other computer. So you just need to make sure that you don't accidentally delete something like that. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. Check out supermacworldnz.com for some more videos on Dropbox.